Hello guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video tutorial, I will show you how to fix Europa Universalis 5 game crashing, crashes startup, crashing to desktop or any other crashing error on PC. So here follow the fixes. The first fix is to simply restart Steam or restart PC. So right click on this arrow icon, then right click on Steam and then click on exit Steam and then relaunch the Steam app and then check if your problem is solved or not. If that doesn't help, then simply restart your PC. And once your PC restart, then you can launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not. Next solution is to modify the game launch options. So open Steam, go to library, right click on Europa Universalis 5 game and then select properties. And then in the launch option, type minus DX11. Close the tab and then launch the game and check. If that doesn't help, then again go to the game properties and this time type minus dx12 and then close the tab and then launch the game this fix has solved the issue for many players so i hope this will work for you as well if that doesn't work then remove this command from the launch options and then follow other fixes mentioned in this video third solution is to update graphic card driver so in windows search type device manager and open it expand the display adapters and then right click on your graphic card and then click on update driver and then click on search automatically for drivers and after this close that and then you can launch the game and check if that doesn't work then you have to perform a clean installation of graphic card driver so if you have amd graphic card driver then go to the amd website if you have nvidia graphic card driver then go to the nvidia website and if you have intel graphic card driver then go to the intel website links are provided in my video description so you have to search and select your correct graphic card driver and then reinstall the latest version of your graphic card driver and then launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not. So I am showing the example of NVIDIA graphic card driver. So go to the NVIDIA website and once you are on this NVIDIA website, you have to enter your version of graphic card driver over here and then select the Windows operating system and then click on find. You have to download GeForce game ready driver. So whatever is the latest version, Currently the latest version is 581.80 so click on this view and then click on download and once this exe file get downloaded and then run the downloaded exe file and select yes to allow and then click ok you will see this screen click on agree and continue and then select custom advanced option and then hit on next then tick mark perform a clean installation box so check mark this perform a clean installation box and then click on next. And after the clean installation of graphic card driver is done, just restart your PC once and then launch the game and check. Next solution is to run Europa Universalis 5 as an admin. So open Steam, go to library, right click on Europa Universalis 5 and select manage and then select browse local files. It will open the game installation folder. The path is C drive, program files, x86, Steam, Steam apps, common, Europa Universalis 5 folder. Then open the binaries folder and then right click on eu5 exe file and select properties and then go to the compatibility tab and tick mark run this program as an administrator hit apply ok and then launch the game from the game installation folder from here itself and check if your problem is solved or not if not then run the eu5 exe file in compatibility settings so again right click on eu5 exe file and select properties go to compatibility tab and tick mark Run this program in compatibility mode 4 from here, select the drop down and select Windows 8 and then hit apply OK and then launch the game from the game installation folder and check. If that doesn't work then from the drop down here select Windows 7, hit apply OK then launch the game and check. If it's still not working then this time select disable full screen optimization option as well then hit apply OK then launch the game and check. If it's still not working then again go to the compatibility tab and untick all these three options and then follow other fixes mentioned in this video. Next solution is to verify the integrity of game files. So open Steam, go to library, right click on Europa Universalis 5 game and select properties. Go to the install files tab and then click on verify integrity of game files. And after the verification has been done, then you can launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not. Next solution is to install Visual C++ files. So go to this Microsoft website. Link is given in my video description. And once you are on this website, scroll down and download both the x86 and x64 version. You have to download both the version. 
so first click on x64 version now if you see repair option then click on repair and if you see install option then click on install and install it then click on x86 version now if you see repair option then click on repair and if you see install option then click on install and install it and then just restart your pc once and then you can launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not next solution is to disable overlay so open steam go to library right click on the game europa universal is 5 game and select properties then turn off enable the steam overlay while in game so turn it off and then you can launch the game and check disable nvidia overlay open nvidia geforce experience settings general turn off in game overlay similarly disable overlay in all apps or close all other overlay apps such as geforce experience nvidia shadow play overlay amd overlay and then launch the game and check you can also close all the unnecessary and unwanted programs such as riva tutor msi dragon so you can close all that unnecessary program and then you can launch the game and check fix then is to allow the game exe files through windows defender firewall and control folder access so in windows search type windows security and open it then click on virus and threat protection then click on manage ransomware protection then click on allow an app through control folder access then click yes to allow then click on add an allowed app then click on browse all apps and then you have to browse to the game installation folder so browse to c drive program files x86 steam steam apps common europa universal is 5 folder open binaries folder and then select eu5 exe file and add it to the list and then go back next click on firewall and network protection then click on allow an app through firewall then click on change settings then click on allow another app and then click on browse now browse to the game installation folder so again browse to c drive program files x86 steam steam apps common europea universal is 5 folder open binaries folder and then select eu5 exe file and then click on add and after adding it click on okay to save changes and then you can launch the game and check now if you are using any third party antivirus program on your pc such as avas komodo casper sky avg so if you're using any kind of antivirus software on your pc then simply allow the game exe file through your antivirus software as well or you can simply turn off your antivirus program then launch the game and check later you can turn it on fix then is to update windows so go to windows settings on the left click on windows update then click on check for updates and if there are any updates available then download and install them and then just restart your pc once and after your pc restart then you can launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not and the last solution is to uninstall and reinstall europea universal is 5 game so if nothing seems to work then simply uninstall europea universal is 5 game from your pc restart your pc and reinstall the game in c drive ssd drive if already installed in c drive then reinstall on another ssd drive or external ssd drive and then you can launch the game and check so by this way you can easily solve europea universal is 5 game crashing crashing at a startup crashes to desktop or any other crashing error on pc so that's all for this video if this video helped you then please like and subscribe to my channel share this video and hit the bell icon to get the latest updates thank you